My experience in working with states on developing and amending their forest laws has always really focused on the individual state and on what's going on within the state. And it never really involved thinking about the issues of organized crime. UNODC's primary objective with this guide is basically to help states, states conserve and sustainably use their forests. And doing that through a strong legislative framework, forest crimes have been considered victimless crimes, that nobody's hurt, it's only wood, but there are millions of people who are hurt by this every year, every day.